Why? Hello and welcome everybody. It is Pox again. So I just wanted to give you guys some little progress updates with what's going on on Path of Diablo. Uh, as you guys can see, I have indeed completed normal difficulty. Uh, congratulations, Pox Kappa will henceforth be known as Destroyer Pox Kappa. So you guys hear that on YouTube, you better start addressing me by my full name. Uh, this was a given to me by the uh, Chief Lord of RuneScape, as you can see here on the left. But anyway, on a real note, I just want to go ahead and show you guys a little bit with what we're doing. So, uh, I'm just going to go ahead and get a quick game up on normal mode to show you guys what we're doing. So this is a pretty standard, um, I don't really know exactly what people play, but it's a pretty standard Bone Necro, I guess. Um, we've got teeth maxed basically up until you can use Bone Spear, and then once you can start getting Bone Spear, I started maxing Bone Spear instead of teeth, and the reason why is that Bone Spear will give it a damage increase without increasing the mana cost. Um, so that way you, you don't have to hate yourself on the mana cost. And then you still have Bone Spear for single target, which does significantly more damage than Teeth. And I don't really know what we're doing later on, this is just what we're doing right now to level. Um, I would recommend grabbing Convocation, but uh, I didn't feel like grabbing it, so it feels bad, man. And I would go at least one point into Decrepify, because Decrepify like slows targets by like 50% speed. Uh, I don't know if the Amplified Damage actually works for your Bone Spear. I'm sure you could find that out with Google. Um, I'm sorry, I can't really tell you 100%. It just says it does Amplify Damage, but I don't know if that's to everything or just physical or magical and physical. You know, I'm not here to mislead you guys. Uh, in terms of our gear, I've just got a standard plus three teeth weapon uh, with a little bit of mana on it. Um, my helmet is just life, energy. The energy roll is actually really good because in Path of Diablo, they changed the scaling of um, a, a lot of skills to be scaled off of energy now as well. So you actually do get a benefit of stacking some energy. On the side note, if you're playing in hardcore like myself, you also want to make sure you have enough life to survive. Uh, my chest piece, I've got stealth. Stealth is very good for basically running through the game. Uh, you get really good faster run walk. You also get faster hit recovery, which prevents like stun locking. Um, you just get a bunch of really good things. I'd highly recommend stealth in your chest piece, which is tall eth. Uh, my gloves, nothing crazy. Boots, I got lucky and found sanders, which give 40% movement speed. Um, your belt, nothing, I don't know, I don't really have anything special here. And my shield, whereas you should make probably like an Ancient's Pledge or a Rhyme, uh, I accidentally misclicked a gem into a shield and said, fuck it, this is my budget shield. So I want to go ahead and run a, is it Ball? Bale? I don't know his name. Let's go do him and see if we die again. I mean, I will, not again, but... All right, let's go to World Keep 2. Now, I don't really know much about Diablo 2 because, you know, I've never really spent a crazy amount of time actually going through it. So I play this game very defensive because I still don't know, like, how much damage everything does and even how a lot of, like, the mitigation even works in this game. I didn't turn on my auras. That's because it's the new update for PoE, man. It uh, snapshots our auras now. So that's level 1, which means I think I need to go this way. Wow! Did they remove Stygian dolls from here, or is it just like RNG if they spawn? I remember seeing the dolls and I'm like really happy that I don't see them anymore. But I'm also really concerned that I don't see them at all. Only a nightmare they spawn? Wow, they want to give the newbies a chance like me, dude, how nice of them. Alright, I cannot figure out where to go for the life of me. Let's go back over here. Remember, if you guys ever want to take tips, you can uh, come to twitch.tv slash box. I'll teach you how to speedrun any game blindfolded. I see that the first step in the speedrunning is you need to cover every single corner, so that way you know that you're not supposed to run that way. So now that we've gotten that covered, we know that we have to go this way. Look at that, see? 
Look at you see that? Can I get a can I get a cap a clap in the chat, please? We got one corner solved. It can't be in this corner. Actually, I could go this way, right? Oh, that sounds like a trap. Okay, we're good. Ah, oh, Crystal Sword 3. If only it was four. Crystal four or Crystal Sword four is what the hell is this? Crystal Sword four is really good because you can do spirit inside it, and it's like the lowest strength base requirement, I believe. Thirty four to forty one. Yo, that's pretty good, too. That's like double his current weapon's damage. It really is. Oh my god. But then he loses the all res. It's okay, dude. He's a tank. Nephrin? Have I found a Nephrin? I don't remember. Get him. Dude, he just punched him. All right, here we go. Wow, did he curse us? What a douchebag. Don't kill me while I'm selecting a skill, please. Wait, does he not have, do I have to like run closer? Hey buddy boy, wake up. Just kidding, I'm just kidding, I'm scared. Wait, why isn't he? Oh, it's because there's a mob alive, maybe? Is that why? That was why. He's mad. He's laughing. Hey, dude, if you talk shit, you're gonna get hit. Come here. Let's go. Feels capping, man? There's an amulet here. Yeah, a lot of rune words have been adjusted, man, for this mod specifically. Alkaiser, don't die! Tank it! Good job, buddy. I had to pop to heal him there, but he's good. Remember, you guys can pick up your very own Alkaiser at uh, Act 2 at a town near you. Isn't there another phase? Oh, just kidding, I lied. Now, ideally, I'd tell you to, like, decrep these mobs, too, but in normal difficulty, everything kind of just falls over because there's, like, very few immunities. Oh shit, there's another round! Uh oh boys. JK. Protect me! <laughs> I'm scared! Okay, we're good, we're good. Alright, now we're good, now we're good. Uh, Jamali was too low level, and I think he stopped getting XP, so we had to trade him out for another, uh, another candidate. Alkaiser has been uh, filling that role quite well. Got him, boys! Never trap yourself in like that unless you have teleport. Hey, dude, there's... I call it the single file line, you see? If if they can't pass through Alkaiser, they can't get to me. Unless they're ranged, but shh, nobody knows that. Alright, guys, so that's pretty much about it. I just wanted to give you guys a little updates with what I'm doing. 
I'll get you guys another update probably at the end of today. But hope you guys had a wonderful time. Hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. And I'll see you boys all tomorrow. Take care, everybody.